Do you see anything wrong with this picture? That's right, I'm out of frame. Much better, hey guys. Hi, I'm I'm still here. Yeah, yeah, I'm stupid. Just drinking my delicious green tea. What is this? A try not to cringe video. Well, but wait, what is this? That's my, uh, we hit eighty subscribers. Well, I guess I should watch this video. All right. So whenever your mom or whatever said, "Why are you drinking that? It's bad for you." You said, "Well, mom, look, do what calories. It's good for me." So you know, you see an excuse to drink. No, no, it's not. Okay, let's get into this. <laughs> this kid is not smart. So. When I open it, See, it is like a splite or something. A splite or something. Oh my, it's, okay. it's, it's like a splite or something. Oh man, look at these cups. The way they clink, it's like a splite or something. Oh my god. It's like a splite or something. You know, when, it, when I went to school, they would always be like, it's like a spider or something. You know what I mean. I'm in frame still. I had to pull up the recording window just to check I was still in frame. That's right. It looks pretty queer, a little murky. L what? It looks a little queer, a little murky? <laughs> Sorry, kid. I, I can't understand him over his very thick accent and or he, and or he sucks at English. Yeah, let's try this. Oh, yeah. So. So, I'm going to cut you off there. This gets the new Joey's World Tour. I knew it. Knew it! Knew it! Whoa, I've never done that in my chair before. I didn't know it can do that. It's very, very strong. Very, very, very cold. But overall, it's pretty good. So I will give monster zero energy or energy zero or He failed. Oh my gosh. Okay, you are. What does America come to these days? What has America done? Oh my gosh. We've been eating all these marshmallows for our whole entire life, and we finally ran out. Hip hip hooray! I'm not touching them. Somebody, one, one of them breaks down on the floor, collapses of lack of sugar, and dies right on the floor. It's probably how it's gonna go down. Let's see. Why? Why? Why are you touching the nasty ones? Why don't you just count how many that was? Because we don't know how many was in the bag we gave them. Yeah, we should have counted those. We should have counted the marshmallows. Touch the nasty ones. Let's count how many this is and try it again. What? I have two phones. One with a broken screen and one from Walmart that I only paid 50 bucks for. Um, my car doesn't work. You know which be you which one's the better phone? No, my car that doesn't work. It's the better phone, right? Let's see. Oh, my vans are dirty. I got vans, but they're dirty. I gotta clean them. So I don't know how to take care of my shoes all the time. But my boots are dirty. Yes, I. I'm, I didn't even buy my own vans. I'm that broke. Did he? I live in a trailer. Did he upload? The, oh my God! Go away! Ads. I go to Walmart to buy most of my stuff. I buy everything myself. My family didn't seem like they cared for me for a while. Why does he? Uh, uh, it's an ICP. A lot of people hate Juggalo, so you can diss me on that. I'm uh, sorry to up, 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 whatever the word is, interrupt you, sir. But first of all, where the hell did he upload this to? Because honestly. 
I could care less. This is not cringy. This is just plain out sad. This man, this man here, this man needs help. This man, this man here, he needs to build a wall. If Trump's going to build a wall, he's going to build a wall around this man. That's all I got to say. Um, I wear pants every day. I don't like... He wears pants every day. That's great. Just... <laughs> Real quality guy. Woo! You know... Oh, wow. Okay. My, my opinion is turned. He wears pants every day. Uh, pants. Wow. Just like the rest of America. Wow. Give this guy some credit. I got glasses. I have a list. My teeth are spread apart. Um, what else can I say? Oh, I'm scrawny. I'm a scrawny white boy. Racist. Hey, can, Thor. Say it to my face. I just said it to his face, didn't I? <laughs> <laughs> Your eyebrows don't match your hair. Oh. <laughs> Greatest cosplay ever. This isn't cringy, this is funny. This is the kind of crap I'd watch on the weekend that my sister would show me because I'm not on YouTube that much. See, okay, so, so, Thor is a representation of Leafy is here, or Keemstar, and these guys, I guess, on the frickin' floor are representatives of channels that Keemstar and Leafy have talked about. I, I don't, I don't frickin' know. I don't, I don't know! <laughs> What's up, every pony? I go by the handle Psychoactive Charm, and for years I have slaved on other ponies' games. <laughs> I've worked as a storyboard artist, a concept artist, an animator, blah blah blah, you name it, I've probably done it. Now, what's this video all about? Brony, 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 It's PG-13, and it doesn't matter if you're a guy, a girl, something in between, or something different entirely. Every pony is gonna be able to enjoy this game. I'm gonna kill myself! Somebody get me a noose! This can't be an amateur effort, folks. And the last time I tried coloring inside the lines, I almost broke my wrist. But enough with all this technical crap. Let's meet the ponies of Royal Pony Academy here in Sears City. My name is Pumpkin Pie. Oh and my I'm god. I'm the smartest pony in the whole school. By my calculations, you'll be falling in love with me. The only question is. Crazy! Crazy! No, but. Crazy! You had it rough? Try growing up without a father. Oh my god. You look like my dad. Maybe I should cut you up just for fun. You think life is tough, then try growing up without a father? <laughs> you know, I'm starting to think that suicide thing I was talking about wasn't a joke. Um, I actually, I actually might take that into consideration. If you want to get to know me better, you'll have to tread carefully. Tread, tread carefully. What are doing? Let me show you a little around. He's wearing a man diaper. Obviously, man. we have our six foot tall diaper tree. After about uh, five or six iterations, here it is. Why did he build a diaper tree? Please don't jump into it. It took forever to build. This man has no life. Then That's... we have 
Our crib. It is seven and a half feet tall. Why? You are not getting into this without assistance. I don't care how tall you are. What if you have muscle? But it is a lot of fun. To get we'll into? Have some teddy bears and other things like that in there as the days go by. We're constantly going to be adding things to it. To the entire space, in fact. This man is literally a man baby. Hi, this is Pamper Chew. I found a really neat park that's really big. It's for the college students. Let's go. It's for the college students. Let's okay. go. He's gonna eat it. I'm calling it. There! I'm into the top. Falls. Okay, go off. down to the hammock. Go down to the... Lay in it. Yeah. Lay in it and do an, uh, do an upside down twist. No. I'll fall out. No. It'd be funny. Be a man! <laughs> you baby. Flip it! Do it like the rest okay, of Americans. Hold on dearly, now squirrel go over there and turn it around. This is an American simulator? That'll hurt. Squirrel can do it and I'll spin off. Okay. <laughs> Being told to put all of your thoughts into one post never sounds so interesting. So, here's my thoughts all put into one single post. So, I figured I might as well save my fingers the trouble of typing and just go out and flat out on say it. I couldn't give two fucks about anybody or anything on this planet. Same! And the reason for that is I find everybody's intellectual intelligence far less superior than that of my own. So I couldn't give two fucks about what happens to anybody or anything on this planet. I could care less about and Kim Kardashian. Watching, if something does happen to you, I won't care either. Well, I wouldn't go that I don't far. Care if anything bad or if anything good happens to you. I'll praise you, yeah. But I'm not going to care. That's cringy. It's real, real cringy. Did it? Oh my gosh. M&M's man. The M&M's man. Candy man can cause he mixes it with... Really? Stop it! There's been so many ads throughout this whole entire video. I may emphasize that I do, but I really won't. I thought it was over when so the ad started. Advice. Kill yourself. So, anyway... <clears throat> We all know about the great bronies here, right? Yeah. All right, but oh no, it's PonyCon. Uh, yeah. <laughs> all right. <laughs> all right, ladies and gentlemen, this is what keeps happening up here. Somebody says closer, and the person goes, "I want the mic right bumping almost into your chin, okay?" Yay. It's antiseptic foam rubber, and you don't have to worry about catching anybody's cold. All right. So anyway, yeah, there we go. There we go. <laughs> we know about everyone here and how great the show is, right? However, as most of us are aware, there's a darker side to the fandom, which we know pretty well. To Mrs. Oliver and Miss Libman. Great. What? What are they talking about? Alright, so I'm pretty sure you're aware of Princess Celestia being portrayed as a tyrant, an irrenatural, and God forbid, a molester. And, and Pinkie Pie and Fluttershy on occasion... Mm -hmm. No. I'm um, canceling this Yeah, question. so I'm gonna let you know from where All I right. stand, the darker side of the fandom yeah. is not part of Guess it. Guess what? I'm not a girl. Please don't call me a girl. I'm not a girl. Oh god, it's cringy. I'm not a girl. Did you just assume my gender? I'll let you know that I sexually identified is this coffee mug! Ah! Ah! Not a girl, but you have a feminine voice. Not a girl. Not a girl. You look like a. Not a girl. But you talk like. Saying. Not a girl. But you have. Not a. Sorry about I'm that. Down. I don't have female parts. But yeah, I'm gender neutral. But are you a boy or a girl? I'm a potato. Then what do you sexually identify is the real question. Uh, that was too cringy. <laughs> too cringy. I'm so glad I ended it on a good note. 
So let's just go back and uh, view this great part of the video. Yeah, perfect. Just beautiful image to end on. Oh my gosh. Can't believe we hit, uh, well, what do you think? How many subscribers did I say at the beginning of the video? 80? Yes? No. Nope. You were not 90. Oh! Stop overestimating. 90 soon. Maybe. Hopefully. Hopefully. I can't wait. <laughs> Thank you guys. All the support. Crazy. Oh my gosh. Uh, tell me in the comments below if you cringed at all. Um, I didn't cringe because I do not cringe. I've only cringed once in my life. I know. I know. You're welcome. But anyways. Yeah, that was the try not to cringe challenge and I succeeded. You all suck if you cringed. And you should probably just go rethink your life. So anyways, I will see you guys later. Bye bye. You guys are amazing. Thank you for supporting me through this whole thing. It's been amazing. Just kidding about rethinking your life, because some people might take that seriously. And then I'll have to go rethink my life.